Hey, what's up, everybody? Uh, welcome to our podcast. Uh, this is our first podcast. It's uh, me and Dave right now. Only me and or me and David. I don't know. What do you like, David or Dave? Uh, I don't or know. Like, I see nobody. Like nobody about. really calls me Dave except you. But I like it. It's like yeah. You know. Yeah, I don't know why. I I, that's weird. Yeah, I started calling people Dave now. Oh, like when do I, everybody? When I, yeah, well, if like if I'm like around like a David, even like my uncle's name is David. Yeah. And so I call him like, hey, Dave, what's going on? Like, no, I don't actually. I don't know why I just said that. <laughs> I don't call him Dave. I don't know why. I just well, have you ever David. called, like, have you always called David's Daves? Or is it just, like, did it no, start with it, me? I think it, well, I was on, I was on Twitter. I did something. All right. Well, I'll get into this later on, but I did something with David Dobrik yesterday. And I called him Dave when I first met him. Yeah. And then I like when I was, you know, tweeting something, I called him, you know, Dave too on Twitter. I don't know I don't know why. It just it just it just came out like what's going on, Dave? Like I don't know why. And it's same with you too, like your name's Dave. Yeah. So I just I'm I'm just gonna start call. calling you Joe. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, <laughs> My name is Josh. <laughs> that's that's no relevance Joss. to Joe. <laughs> I mean it's Jose. Since <laughs> <laughs> well, since we're like you know, short cutting words or names. Yeah. Yeah. Well, anyways, so uh, hey, everybody, uh, this is our first podcast. Uh, this is our D seven podcast. Oh, first episode. It's, it's, me and, it's first, ep- first, first podcast. Episode. First episode. Yeah. First podcast. First episode. Yep. And uh, and so it's me and David right now. Um, our full na- yeah, like I guess if you like want to know our full names, I get, my name is like Josh Van Bamberg. His name is David Takla. Right? Is that how you pronounce it? Yeah. You got it. Yeah, David Takla. And then uh, our other friend that's going to be joining us, he's he's at his uh, grandmother's funeral today, so he's going to be with <laughs> us. <laughs> that's not that funny, David. I don't know why you're laughing. <laughs> no, he's not at his grandmother's funeral. He's, because... he's editing a video right now. Our, oh so we're basically, we're a bunch of like, a- anyways, no, our other friend Shane, he's, uh, Shane he's not at his grandmother's funeral. Yeah, Shane Danahy, if you guys want to like look him up on social media or anything. But uh, he's <laughs> editing a video for like, you know, his like, little business that he's doing he you know he makes like videos for different like companies and you know different people that you know want him to make videos for them so that's what he's doing right now so he can't join us for the first yeah because we said we would like fine yeah because we said we would do like start monday so we don't like procrastinate so it's just like yeah you know he couldn't make it yeah yeah he could make it today which is fine um we're we're not sure when we're gonna put you know any of these podcasts up um and shane's gonna be editing them so he's gonna edit this tomorrow morning and then put it up wednesday so the first episode okay. should be up Wednesday. So if you guys are listening to this, it should be going up Wednesday. Yeah. I don't know the date. So, you know, oh well. But uh but yeah. So let's get into this. Um I guess oh yeah, what I want to talk about is um Yeah, oh yeah. So I'll talk about this. Or David, did you want to talk about your story first? Um I think I think let's go with yours first cuz we'll okay, probably transition just to get it eventually. Yeah, cuz I I already mentioned it. So uh but yeah, if, if um or I guess we can introduce ourselves. So like, yeah, my name's Josh. I do. Um, I live in LA. And I very far away from David, where David lives. Yeah. David lives in Massachusetts, <laughs> in in Massachusetts. Um, but yeah, I live in LA. Um, we used to be roommates um, at college together back in back at Fitchburg University. We used to be uh, college roommates there, and then we came up with the idea to do D seven. This you know this kind of like what media production company I guess you could call it that. I mean, I don't like honestly. At this point, it's like we're gonna go with the flow and see what it turns into. But like for now, exactly. it's, uh, it's for us, now you know? we're starting a podcast. Yeah. That's like what we're doing right now. Um, but because uh, that way we also yeah, so keep we in up, touch. You know? Yeah, we, we came up with this idea, and you know, like when I lived back in you know, you know, Massachusetts, and you know, we started doing you know a couple episodes. It wasn't really working out because you know, being him, me and him were working seven days a week. Now, I am kind of doing YouTube. Um, I would go to school three days a week. And Dave goes to you know the same college still now five days five days a week still but you know he commutes so it's probably easier to get the podcast done and yeah. to get different stuff done so hopefully that'll be nice um, but yeah so I live in L A him and Shane oh Shane actually lives in Connecticut <laughs> yeah it's not, we're all it's, it's, from it's, like it's, three it, random spots yeah yeah we're all, <laughs> that's right we're all in different states I'm in California <laughs> across the world and you guys are I mean you guys are right next to each other I've been, uh, we have like one person in Australia like. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, we're yeah. all Our over the world. Jack lives in uh, Iran. <laughs> what? Um, he's uh, he lives in a bunker. How did know. you <laughs> get Iran? Especially for Zach. I, was, I won. I don't know. I don't, yeah, Zach is not. We have a friend Zach. He's like the nicest person in the world. I hope he he's hears this person. too. He's, he's just like he's not a person to live in that sort of country, which is really funny. Or go into war or anything. It's really funny. 
<laughs> but uh, right, anyway, let me. So yeah, that's what we do. I, I do YouTube uh, and like entertainment. I, I came out of California because like you know I'm trying to like get in like the film industry and you know entertainment industry. I guess you could say. Um, so I have you know some things that are going on. That's why I moved out here in the first place, and you know I transferred colleges too. And then David, you know you can explain to yourself. Um. Yeah. So I mean, for me, I kind of I don't do I don't I wouldn't say like like you you're kind of following the like your YouTuber thing and the film kind of uh, career for you. You're kind of following it like head on, I guess. For me, I still don't know just yet, but some of the things I do I, is you know music production. Um, and honestly, I would say like I feel like of all the things that I do is it, that that and I guess like some of the like three D art is kind of my two main things for now that yeah. I'll say out loud for now. But I'm working on other stuff, and we'll you know we'll see where it goes. Yeah, but I, I'm gonna yeah, and I'm gonna be focusing like mainly on what we're trying to you know get into I guess later on with our, this whole project as the D seven yeah, project. Sure. So yeah, of course. Um, yeah. So that's kind of it for now but it, it'll get more interesting i guess over the the years we'll see yeah, yeah all right and then what shane does i mean i kind of already explained what shane does but shane he's like a video editor you know he's a film filmmaker i guess you could say he edits videos he's a graphic designer he's a photographer he does he, he's a jack of all trades he does a lot of stuff yeah so but um but yeah so he's doing his little thing in connecticut right now or not little thing it's you know becoming very big you know with his thing on instagram so he's, he's doing a good job with that uh, but yeah, so let's get in, just get into the, get into telling stories and different things, and hopefully you guys um, follow us on our journey. I don't know, I didn't know what to say there. I was yeah, I mean, like spitball stuff. <laughs> but anyways, um, yeah. So yesterday I was with David Dober, or I wasn't with David Dobrik. I yeah, mean, you were just hanging I out with him. For like, I was, yeah, I was hanging out with him. I was up at his house. No, um, he had a pop up shop in California yesterday, um, Saturday and Sunday both. I went to the Saturday one just to kind of see what it was like, you know, to see how many people were there. Oh my god! There was a ton of I, there, I was I, I I was telling you earlier there was a ton of people there. There was the line was I pull I pulled in. It, this was around like nine o'clock. The place didn't open till ten. Or yeah. No, like his place didn't open till ten. The mall was already open. There was probably there was a five hour wait when I got there. At five 9 o'clock hour. Inside. Five hours, insane. And then I was talking to the kid there, and I was like, Yeah, I'm just I'm a photographer. I I I started up a photography page recently, or not recently, a couple months ago. And uh, I wanted to obviously get pictures of, you know, I mean, L.A., you see, like, celebrities, like, all the time. Like, I think, yes, like, a couple days ago, I was walking at the Grove, which is a big shopping center, and I saw a Fousey tube. I saw Yusuf actually? walking down there. Yeah, and I ran into him, and I was like, hey, what's going on, Yusuf? And he was like, yo, what's going on, bro? And I um, I was talking to him about, like, the weather because it was so nice out because I told him I was just moved from Boston. He was like, all right, well, hey, I got to get running, but I uh, hope you enjoy L.A. You know, see you later. And I was like, hey, see you later. Yeah, it was kind of funny. That's yeah, so funny. I ran to Fuji, too. He was, he was, he's a nice guy. Um, but it's just like – it's kind of like – and then I um, – like, later on that night, I was at uh, – I was at, like, these light – it was like a, it's like a light art exhibit kind of thing. It's, like, right on the side of the street. Um, and I mean, everybody takes pictures there. It's basically just a bunch of like light posts, like in a row. <laughs> and I saw Brianna Stewart there and Brianna Stewart's a professional women basketball player. And she was, she played for UConn, like UConn women's basketball team. If anybody's a sports, like if anybody's like a, like a sports person that's listening to this, UConn, like women's basketball team is a huge basketball team and they win all the time. Is this all the same um, day? Yeah, it's all the same day. Jeez. Yeah, so I, talk, I saw two celebrities in the same day, and, well, um, and three. I wanted to take three. Oh well, no, yeah. no, this wasn't yesterday. Oh, oh, okay. This was this was a couple of days ago. Yeah, but I, I, I ran into them. It, this is kind of just explaining like what celebrities you can see. Like I ran into like you, Fuji Tube, which celebrity is a big down at the mall, and then Brianna Stewart's a huge women's basketball player. I mean, I guess if you're a sports fan, you recognize her. Yeah, but um. I didn't take. I wanted to like go up to her and take her pictures, like ask if I could like, shoot her for like my photography reel, mm -hmm. and I didn't, and I was so pissed. But like, re like we, me explaining, like I was down at you know the mall yesterday at David's pop up shop to see if I was able to like um, on Saturday to see if I was able to like get you know any like the vlog squad members and you know like my photo you know reel on my photography page, but I didn't because it was insanely packed and there was thousands yeah. of people there. You should have asked yesterday, the Sunday. Uh, what's her name again? Say that again. The what's the basketball uh, player's name? Oh, Brianna Stewart. 
Yeah, you should have asked her because I mean you wouldn't have you wouldn't have lost. Oh no, she anyway. she would have done it for sure. Yeah. Oh, she's wicked cool. Oh yeah, she would have been like, yeah, sure, dude. And then she like would have like started doing like funny poses, and she was there with a bunch of her girlfriends. So oh my god, it would have been a blast. I'm really pissed off that I missed out on the opportunity, but it's okay. But yeah, so Sunday I went to David Bowie's Proper Shop Sunday and. I, I had a challenge that I wanted to do with him, and he's you know he likes he's a money guy. He talks about money a lot. Not like him making a ton of money, but like he gives away like you know he gives away cars, he gives away money. So like obviously you know he likes doing stuff with money. <clears throat> and so I was like, well, I'm not rich, <laughs> but I have some money, and so I I took a thousand dollars out of my account. And I went down to the I went down to the pop up shop with a thousand dollars on my camera. I have a vlog channel, and so I was like, I want to rock paper scissors. I want to rock paper scissors, David Dobrik, uh, for a thousand dollars. And so that was like the bit. Like I went down there to shoot that, and I got in line like wicked early, so I made sure like I met him, and I did. I got in line at like six thirty. It was awful. I got in line a little <laughs> early in that. I just don't want to say what time I got in the line, <laughs> but um. So I was I was waiting in line and like five hours later he came around and I was like yo what up Dave and um, and we did like the the rock paper scissors he didn't have he didn't have a thousand dollars he only had his he only he didn't have a thousand dollars he was like he was wicked he was wicked cool about it too. Dude, what kind like, of celebrity doesn't have a thousand dollars in their pocket dude no that's, <laughs> yeah, that's right, just no. ridiculous and so he's like I don't have a thousand dollars to give you but I do have cash in my wallet and i'll give you whatever the cash in my wallet he starts pulling out like coins (laughs) yeah right yeah he says i got 50 cents (laughs) no 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 so he took out he had like i think it looked like he had like 150 bucks in there so he took out all the 20s and it was like 100 bucks and so we wagered 100 dollars in rock paper scissors which i found out today from people that were like messaging me that that's a lot of money for rock paper scissors match <laughs> like i didn't realize it until after i was watching back the interview or, yeah the interview after i was watching back the clip he, when he was counting like the money to he was like all right one rock paper scissors match 20 40 60 80 100 bucks one one rock paper scissors match for a hundred dollars <laughs> wait was it even like, out of three or was it just one like one round. No, it was just like it was just like rock paper scissors shoot. Like that's it. That was it. That was it. That's literally gambling. That's straight up gambling at that point. Like it you're is. Putting... Yeah, we were gambling in front of hundreds and hundreds of people, and and it was so weird because I looked like to my left, and I saw like you know like Natalie, which is like his assistant, and then I saw like Jack Reed, which is his manager. So I saw like his assistant, his manager, his publicist. They were like all like standing there then i saw like the whole fan joy crew was there and then the guy who was filming it was one of the fan joy um i don't know i mean i don't know if he was filming it for david's channel i'm pretty sure it was it was fan joy's photographer or yeah. like film film guy who was there and he like took my camera and was like filming it and then i looked to like my, my right as i'm like as i'm about to like rock paper scissors and i see like literally hundreds and hundreds of kids watching me and david rock paper scissors and like i see like 15 <laughs> cell phones like come up throughout the crowd and start filming me and david and i was like holy crap this is a lot because it was pretty it was cool it was can you fun. imagine if you lost it i would have sucked yeah it would suck but i mean well i, I guess you were like... prepared for it in the sense though yeah, you, you were going in with a thousand, not a hundred. I was going in with a thousand dollars. Oh my god! Yeah, I was going with a thousand. I was prepared to like lose a thousand and be like, you know what? We'll have a rematch, freaking next weekend, dude. Let's freaking go. Next I'm totally weekend. down. It's like but every yeah, week you guys meet up. To, every like, week we meet up at like some. Yeah, that would be funny. Uh, but yeah, no, that's it. that's my little David Dobrik story. How I won hundred dollars, and yeah, he gave me hundred bucks. That's hilarious. And then I got a sweatshirt. And then I got gas and I got groceries. With the hundred dollars, yeah, now hundred dollars is gone. <laughs> groceries is fifty bucks. Gas was thirty. Sweatshirt was forty. Hundred ten bucks down the drain. <laughs> just goes through his, your whole like, like just. Um... I could have really used that thousand. That would have been. Good. <laughs> well, nice you're ready to lose dollars. it, dude. I was ready to lose. If I lost it, oh my god. I I feel like I mean in I'm you know actually you know what. I was gonna say I was gonna I was about to say this, but I was about to say like if I like if I lost I I, I feel like he would be like you know are you like are you sure that you want to give me and this? Be like, be like yeah, I would be like yeah, dude. It's, You'd be like no square and, and then well in, in like in my head I was like maybe like he would be like 
no, you. Like, I'm not taking a thousand dollars from like a random stranger. You, like, I can't let you do that. That's absurd that you would actually give me that. Thank you though for like you know t- asking me. I want you next but, time like, to go with, like two thousand dollars and he actually takes it. Like he wins and he <laughs> actually takes it, and you're like, I just keep doubling. No. It. Next weekend, if I if I end up seeing him in the street, I'll do two hundred. No, no, I'll do the thousand. Just I'll, bet your car. Go, dude. Keep going up. Just bet just your whole car. Up. Your whole keep car. Up, your house. Until, like freaking your everything. Grand. Yeah, I bet my car. Yeah, that'd be fun. Oh my god! But, well, yeah, hit your yeah, car for his car, like not a bad trade. You no, know. yeah, I'd like a Ferrari a or a Tesla. Uh, what does he? What does he have? Does he have a Ferrari? He has a Ferrari and a Tesla. What? Yeah. He it's drove, ridiculous. What did he drive yesterday? He he, he got driven yesterday. He didn't take his Tesla, but yeah, that's no, funny. Oh, if you guys heard that, it's my mom. Hmm. I I didn't hear anything. It's oh, you didn't? Sil- yeah, I think it's probably silent. Well, now it's not silent because we made a whole, you know. Now it's a whole thing in the podcast, like. Yeah, but uh, but yeah. Do you have any stories to tell? Did you, um, did you play rock paper scissors for a thousand dollars this weekend? I did not get to play rock paper scissors. Actually, I, this weekend I've literally just been setting up a lot for a lot of this. But I saw today. I was like, um, I was at work and I saw the, like on my YouTube like you know feed. It was like I didn't yeah. watch the video, but it was literally like a PewDiePie video, and it, the and it was, it was so funny because he uh, in the what do you call it the thumbnail. They, he was like, you know, I got married today. I, I oh, killed. Oh, PewDiePie. <laughs> yeah, and then he was like, I got, yeah. I got, um, I killed the Ender Dragon today, and <laughs> and I reached a hundred million subs, which is crazy. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah, it's I so mean, yeah. crazy. I was but like, like, that's well, well. First off, let's just talk. That's about That's a crazy week for him. For one second, he got yeah. married. In, no, the priority in is the Ender Dragon. Subscribers. No, the, the, the Ender, priority. Yeah, the Ender the, Dragon, right? Come on. <laughs> to be fair, no, like, he crazy, probably was though. trying to time that, and it's kind of crazy that he was able to kill the Ender Dragon that to, week. To, to kill the Ender Dragon. Yeah, because, like, dude, like, you're sitting, like, yeah, because imagine that weekend, you're sitting there, you're like, I'm really behind. Like, I, I live in a hut. How am I going to kill the Ender Dragon on that same week? He got to step it up, you know what I mean? I'm just saying. I think yeah, it's yeah. a it's yeah, difficult. Dude, that's that's freaking awesome. That's crazy. I mean, it I know, crazy. like, that whole thing with, um, I don't even remember the company's name. There the T-Series? Yeah, T series. Yeah, yeah I've, I not to be like an, like not to be like an asshole or like a Debbie Downer, but like they're they're like a huge corporation. Well, yeah, I mean that's what, and he, why and he's, everybody and he's was one on his and side. he's one person. Yeah. So I feel like if like if there's anybody to be like recognizable for like hitting a million subscribers, I mean yeah, a million, a hundred a hundred million subscribers should be should be. To be fair, his content is also better. So I mean, <laughs> like, well, it's yeah, it's also because we can't understand Indian. Well, I guess it's that too. <laughs> like but, their language yeah. is it? Oh, did I fuck up? Is is it called? Is there a language in? in is it? In no, language? it's not. It's not. <laughs> That's not it? a language. I mean, I don't know. There's like I don't know how many. There's a lot of languages there. I'm pretty sure. What do they speak? God damn it, Dave! I don't, I don't know. Up. It's fine. <laughs> I'm gonna I look mean... like an asshole now. <laughs> <laughs> well. <laughs> That's too bad, dude. Just give him a thousand. I just, I just, just give him a thousand. Said, like, just give him a thousand dollars. I just said I don't speak Indian. Like, <laughs> you're shitting me. I'm gonna look like a douche. And then you asked me to double down. You're like, are you sure they don't speak? Indian? No, I just wanted to make sure. I mean, it's fine. No, but yeah, well, yeah. no, it's a totally different language, not English. That's on their channel. It's yeah. like it's like no, a totally I, well, different think... like language. Like yeah. all their music is like in a different language. Yeah, so I don't know, but I. I it was kind of weird too because I was watching. I think last week, I people were like all talking about it, like him potentially reaching it, and he was stuck at like ninety nine for a while, like literally for yeah, a month. He was, he was stuck. He was stuck between like ninety seven and ninety nine for like yeah. Three, and it's three weird months. that like as soon as he had a hundred, he like got another 100. hundred subscribers in three months. Guys is insane. Yeah. But when you're at ninety seven million people, it's it's well, not. I thought like everybody stuff. would want to like like get him to just the hundred push him up. yeah which yeah. it didn't happen for a while but once he did i'm looking right now um he, he yeah he he's grew up pretty dude, fast yeah like it took him forever to get a hundred and once he got a hundred he's now three hundred sixty five thousand more that he got like after oh, so is that, yeah he's a hundred 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 million three hundred fifty thousand a hundred three sixty five so he got three like so he got like four oh he, four, he dude he had a hundred like literally less than like 36 hours ago yeah, so dude, he's he basically like jumped half a mil from that ninety nine like mil, like oh my god, he jumped a half a mil and go in literally less than. Because the thing is, here's the thing, it, it's like it's one of those Holy things crap, of as dude. soon as he hit the hundred and then made the video of him saying, well, it's, it's "Oh, a I made big, 100, yeah, a hundred, everybody yeah, was like, you know. it was on Twitter, YouTube tweet about it, every everybody was tweeting about it. It's just crazy because it's just it, it's like, so funny because like he was like the is? talk for like this week. It was like literally like. 
Yeah. PewDiePie got married, Matsuya, and then, um, and then you know he hit 100 million subscribers. Killed the Ender Dragon. He killed the Ender Dragon. Yeah, he did a lot, which is crazy. Uh, I love the fact that he went back to him. Is that like, I I didn't watch any of them, but like I'm shocked that it's like such a thing now. And also, is it what, coming? Minecraft? Yeah, like is it also coming back in general, or is he kind of? I'm sure he was a big part of it coming back, but like how much Mine, of it is? Yeah, is it him? what like, I feel like. Yeah, well, I mean, I don't watch a lot of gamer YouTubers besides... I mean, I watch Vanoss still. I've watched Vanoss for a really long time. I, I like watched Vanoss did for like a bit, but Black, I stopped. Like Call of Duty Black Ops came out, which is insane. Like, that's a really uh, old game now. Dude, I, I mean, it's like, not really know. old. It's like, what, 2011? Still a long time. It's like eight... No, not that long. I, I didn't know. play the first. I've been Black watching. House, I've been. I've been pretty. I've been watching Vanos before GTA came out. And GTA came out six years. Yeah, ago, that's when he blew September. up too. Like so that that's a that's a long time. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, I've been watching Vanos for like six seven years, and yeah, I still watch him now today. He, but he's like the only gamer YouTube that I watch though. Does he still do the Gmod stuff? Yeah, dude, he still does Gmod. <laughs> How do you did... play one game for that long? He's been that playing one game crazy. for the longest time. I mean, he well, he does. I'm, I'm trying to think of the games. I mean, he does a bunch of games. We, his main games are yeah, Gmod, you know, GTA. So does GTA, and then he yeah. now he does Minecraft. His group of friends <laughs> are kind of cool though. Like they're pretty. Yeah, his fun. group of friends are freaking hilarious. Wait, so he plays yeah. Minecraft too though? Yeah, he plays <laughs> Minecraft with. Um, oh my yeah, like, god! Yeah, like Nogla and I am Wildcat and Terrorizer. And Honestly some, though, like what guys. a game for it to stand the test of time for this long. It's crazy. Yeah. Like, I remember it coming out. It's crazy. Oh, Minecraft. Yeah, Minecraft is huge. Yeah, it, it feels... You can do anything you want. You can yeah, build anything you want. But it, I mean, it, it was it, out of blocks. It feels but, like it's I mean, been it out, though, for, like, super long time. But at the yeah, same time, it's honestly only been since, what, like... Was it 2000... No, not 2010. 8, maybe? Yeah, 2008, maybe. But right around when, like, Iron Man came out, the freaking hit of the world. Robert Downey Jr. I love Robert Downey Jr. so much. <laughs> oh, speaking of... Uh, 2009, by the way. Keep going. All right, but yeah, speaking of like Robert Downey Jr. and Marvel, um, a big thing came out on Twitter today. I was, I was reading it. Um, so Black Widow, first official Black Widow poster reveals David Harbour's Red Guardian, which is actually sick because I love Marvel and I love Black Widow and I love David Harbour because, you know, he was in Stranger Things. So I love Stranger Things and it's freaking awesome. Wait, what? Character. He was? Yeah, he was, in, he was David Harbour. was um like the, the cop in Stranger Things. Oh, 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 I'm sorry. I... I mix names, but yeah, no, no, I know, yeah, obviously, duh. Yeah, but you know, <laughs> you know the cop, yeah, it's like, yeah, yeah, no, I, or like Eleven's I, dad, like in the, in yeah, the yeah, show. no, I know he is, yeah. I, I'm a big fan of the yeah. show, but I just oh, yeah, out on his name. show's dope, but yeah, no, they're coming out, they're starting to come out with like all of like the Marvel, like TV shows on Disney Plus, oh my god, oh. Well, speaking of Marvel, have you seen? Have you heard about the whole? Yeah, well, I'm, I'm sure you've heard the Spider-Man thing. I don't even want to talk about it. I'm, I'm wearing a Spider-Man it's... shirt actually right now. Oh, you are? Or, I mean, no, no, I'm not. I was wearing it yesterday. <laughs> in the video. I was wearing. It, I was. I was wearing it yesterday during like the David thing, and I was watching the video. And no, it's Spider-Man it's quite shirt. sad. But did you hear about the whole uh, like Stanley's daughter getting involved? Well, what happened? She no, she got involved, and she's taking Sony's side. And she's like, no one could have treated my father worse than Marvel and Disney's executives. And she's like, what? We, yeah, and she's like, nah, she doesn't want Disney to like go through with it. No. She's all upset. It's like a whole thing. Really? Yeah. To be oh fair, to be fair though, like, like realistically, Sony is in the right. Like, like, it's well, just it sucks. Like, yeah, it's one because, of those situations where it's they... like an icky situation. Yeah, it stinks. It the only thing I mean, I I don't I don't want to get like I don't I don't you know but not political or like business side or whatever it's just it's i don't know like why is spider-man like like why is he like in sony's position in the first place he's a marvel character no but he was owned by sony like to begin with like he's he's in the sony well, not, pictures like from the very beginning like like back well, from, from when toby mcguire's thing yeah but i'm curious like why did like marvel well because Mar- no no but marvel wasn't part of disney before remember Oh, like it was only it was bought like recently. A, it was like a, yeah, it was like so a comic book thing. Exactly, and not all the, yeah. the heroes were movies. So it was just Spider Man. Yeah, and, that's right. And so it probably, they needed yeah, a production yeah. company exactly. to make the movies, so they, right. cho- and, they chose Sony. And Sony had them forever now. And here's yeah. the thing too: and, it's, then, and then Marvel was bought by Disney. Yep. Oh, damn it, and, dude. But it's not just that too. Like I'm so honestly, pissed about that. Dude. I don't know. Do you know what is exactly I mean, the the deal that Disney's proposing? It's kind of insane. It's ridiculous. No, I I don't even want to talk about it. It's I don't care. So dumb. I, I don't. I mean, it. I just. I like Tom Holland, and I, I like him. I love he's a him cool too. Yeah. Kid. yeah, he's a, he's a cool kid. He's a kid. He's, he's a, my favorite. He's Twenty three years old. Yeah, he's my favorite Spider Man by far. I know Stan Lee like said something about like him being the yeah, favorite Spider Man. Yeah, it's his favorite. 
But, like, yeah, I just like Tom Holland. And when I was reading, like, you know, everything when it all happened, I was like, oh, my God, I'm I'm not going to watch another Spider-Man movie when Tom Holland's not Spider-Man. At least right now. Like, in five years, if they make another Spider-Man, whatever, I'll be friggin' 24 and I'll be, like, you know, I won't be, like, you know, a kid. I'll be 24. And I mean, yeah. I'm still going to be a kid when I'm 24. But <laughs> I'm saying, like, right now, like, the Spider-Man movie came out, you know, it was a huge, like, what about the cliffhanger at the end? Like a I, huge cliffhanger. I was gonna bring it up, but I didn't know if it was like it is kind of a spoiler. What the hell? Are you, what are you gonna do now? Well, no, he like, is, he is signed for a third movie, so he's gonna have to make the third movie. But oh, after God. that, nobody has a clue what's gonna happen. Oh, like, thank, okay, that's fine. I mean, fin- I don't care. Is, Just yeah, finish yeah. the fucking cliffhanger. But it's, it does suck I, though. I was, like it really sucks. When I when I found out, like I thought they weren't gonna do like the third movie. Like I thought they yeah, weren't yeah. gonna do that. I, I so believe he's doing the third movie. With yeah, the I believe that's also why Iron Man hasn't like been showing up in the or hasn't showed up in the last spider-man because i think it's the whole marvel sony thing did he i don't remember him. yeah he was at the beginning like they literally did like a tribute to him at the beginning oh uh, well no but a tribute and then, and, but not him himself well, he's all he's also died but wait but does yeah. that movie take place after oh it does yeah, does, <laughs> yeah, forgot it after. yeah. i watched like, a while he, it's literally tom, tom holland's like crying honestly though <laughs> here's the thing like I, for, I, I forget how it dead. starts no i the the thing that sucks is like robert downey jr is technically done because he died right and then yeah. you've got like he's, tom holland's well, literally he out director, producer now i he might be a producer I don't know. he might turn into like like john i don't know how to pronounce his name john fair john fairview I, he, he was the producer. He, he, yeah, he he did a Lion King movie, and now he's you know he's a, produ- I don't know if he's directing or producing the Mandalorian movie, Disney Channel like D- D- Disney Plus like I don't, the Mandalorian the Star Wars thing. I don't. I haven't, I haven't heard about that to be honest. I, I'm not. But, I don't know. I should probably look up stuff before I just talk about. Stuff. It just it just it's just sad because like <laughs> all these people are gonna be gone because like Spider Man even if he's still there Tom Holland is not acting as him. Tony Stark. No, no, yeah, like he is. Gone. Well, no, but if, if oh, he does. Oh, in the does... third movie. No. Yeah, in the third movie. Oh, but I'm well, saying after no, that in yeah. MCU, like, it's like that, all these fine. people are done I, you know and Tom Holland is not there. I think, so their it's like... be- I think their best thing to do for, like, this, I mean, they create the third movie. It's it's going to it's gonna have to be long. It's just going to have to be a long movie because you got to get everything out of the way and you have to situate everything. I think what they should do is they should just kind of, like, I don't know because it's so weird because he's a young character, and so you would think as a young character. I mean, wasn't he supposed to like kind of take Tony Stark's role? Like they, like they, if you guys watch the movie, there is a scene where he literally is like embodied like Tony Stark's like his thing. Like Robert Downey Jr. Like in the first movie, like he was doing like making the suit and to, like and then happy when they were like in the ship you know, Spider-Man, like, Tom Holland's character, he was, like, making the suit with, like, all, like, the holograms and stuff like that. So it, like, it kind of, like, set up to, like, for him to be, like, oh, I'm, I'm taking over, like, Robert Downey Jr.'s, like, role. Like, that's, I mean, not Iron Man, but, like, I'm gonna be, like, you know, like, his son, you know, kind of thing. So, like, what are they gonna do now? You know, like, how do they just get rid of that role? Like, how do you um, do that? I, I and, I, and I don't and I don't want them to make another Spider Man. I don't know why they would. Like, it, I mean, well, uh, to be curious. fair, well, if Sony keeps them, they will. Why don't uh, especially like, out of spite, if anything, to be honest with you, like I don't know why they would. And, it's, it's, see, it's not going to do. I'm, and as I'm, much I'm, I'm sorry like, to say, I live right down the pic. I write. I live right <laughs> down the street from Sony Pictures. I will go down there. Gonna and go yell at them. No, no honestly, Spider-Man. like that's the funny thing too is like as much as I'm on Sony's side on this, like he they don't make good Spider Man movies. I don't. Yeah, I, like these like, have only been. These are the only ones. good ones, and they've been in partners in partnership Partnered with Disney with for a little bit. In Disney, yeah, yeah. So you know, it's gonna suck, but. You know what Disney should just do? They should just buy Sony. <laughs> I think they should do it. Just buy Sony. That would be so should. ridiculous. I don't think they'd even go for the sale, to be honest. Yeah, it's like $92 billion. But, That's but, how much they are. Yeah, no. I, I, I really want to tell you the deal they proposed. Like, I want you oh, to know. So bad. Like... Okay, so before, right, Sony owned or, like, made 90% of the revenue from the film, and Disney takes 10%. But yep. Disney had all the money, I believe 100% of all the merchandise, like, for Spider-Man. So everything okay. that's sold for Spider-Man is basically goes straight to Disney. It's just that the movie revenue goes to Sony. Now... The deal that they, the Disney wants to make is keep all the same stuff, except it's a 50-50. So it's like Disney yeah, takes 50. Good, no, but, but like they're taking 100% of the merchandise. 
So, like, oh. Sony is making literally at that point nothing. And keep in mind, too, that, it's scary because if Disney keeps trying to go into that and taking Spider-Man, I'm scared also for the Spider-Man game because that Spider-Man game was sick, right? And that's under Sony. Like, that's exclusive. Yeah. So, like, that would also start to eat into there. And it sucks because everybody's boycotting that, too. So now they're boycotting the video game. And I'm like, what is this mess, dude? I, I, think, I think in the big picture, you have to think about the... I'm not saying you. I'm saying, and like, like in the general, like audience, like you have to think about like the MCU, like yeah, like, you know, what's I, that's gonna the, happen yeah. now. I that's like, the thing. That's what the only reason I respect I Disney it. because, like, I mean, they're kind of playing some big business moves. Do you know what I mean? Like, it, it is, and it's fair. It's like they want all of them. It it is making it just unnecessarily complicated. So yeah, but it's it's kind of lame too because I mean, well, yes, well, Marvel is owned by Disney, right? Now they are, yeah, it, yeah. I mean, they should they should have all the superhero characters. Like it's Marvel. Like they're superheroes. Like that's right, what yeah. they are. Like Sony doesn't have any superheroes. Why do they have Spider Man? Well, I think they, I think they actually they have Venom too. <laughs> yeah, which is dumb. Like it's, it's not weird. a it's not, a, have, so, like, it's not a Sony Venom. character. There's no Sony. There was no back in back in like the sixties. Yeah. But Stanley, to be fair, it's like yeah. But to, to like, be fair, Disney doesn't have any of them either. Right, like it's like now they yeah, but, bought but, all but, of them. But they, who, I feel like whoever owns the company gets the characters. I feel like that's that should be it. I guess. Like I, I don't know why it does. Would like have the characters split off into like different companies. Like that. Yeah. No. No. Really I agree. Sense. It's weird. But it, but it does like, complicate no things Sony too. Like there's no Sony comic books. Like they're, they're Marvel <laughs> comics. That's it. Yeah. Like I don't but know see, why Sony like, in, has it buys. Like, but did you watch the Spider Verse though? Like the Spider Verse yeah. was kind of freaking sick, and that was Sony. That was pure story. I don't think that Disney was involved in that at all. I don't think. And that yeah, was that, that's such fine a sick too, movie. But that's that's not that's not that's not like it's still part of it. Like... But it's Marvel, and that's my yeah, point. Is like that's... like I, I and, and that's what I'm saying. It complicates things with Stan Lee's daughter like getting involved and being like, oh, Disney's well, I... always been like, you know, they're not honoring his like whatever, and they've always t- like taken advantage of him. And Disney's just playing with the whole like we have money, so we can just throw it around. Like yeah, I guess. So it is I mean, kind it, of it weird. Kind of, it just kind of stinks because now like the MCU timelines like all messed up, and like, yeah. everybody that's like a fan of it is like, I, oh, then what are we gonna do now? Like, yeah, what's Tom Holland just not gonna be a character in it? Like, what happens to Spider? Like, Spider Man played a huge role in the MCU, and he's just gone. Do you know what's like, scarier? It doesn't make any sense. Is imagine if all the other actors like refuse to do the acting roles for their heroes because, of, because there's a lot of them on Tom Holland's side. And none of them, yeah. like, they were all upset about that. Oh, yeah, like, Mark so, Ruffalo, yeah. like, he tweeted no, about it. Um, who else tweeted about it? Don Cheadle, I think, tweeted about it. Um, There's another one, but I don't, I forget his name. Uh, oh like, God. the Hawkeye um, actor. Yeah, Jamie, yeah, Jamie Renner posted on Instagram yeah. about it. Oh, yeah. yeah, no, there's a, there, in, there's in, a lot. Mark Ruffalo and Jamie Renner, they're the, they're the original Because Tom Holland is sick, too, original, like, he's, everybody six loves him, so it's like, I don't he's know, it's, cool it as hell. He's a nice kid, too, you know, he's fucking awesome, he's great. Like, someone's take that I had heard about it is uh, the fact that, like, Disney's kind of doing it as, like, a little bit of a publicity stunt. Because if Sony refuses, then they get, they look as the, like, they seem like they're, they're the bad guys. And if they agree, then they get more of the money anyway. So it's like, it, they put Sony in this, like, corner. Do you know what I mean? Oh, like, they cornered I them. I hate, I hate so when it's things just, come it's down to money. crazy. Yeah. That's no, like it's, it's crazy. Thing. And uh, to be fair, though, it's like, I if mean, you were Sony, though, like, would you want to give away, like, it's like... I don't. It's, it's if difficult. I was Sony, like, if I worked I for know. Sony, I would be like, if I take this character, everybody's gonna hate me. I, I, because everybody doesn't really like. Nobody's on Sony's right. side right now because it me because because it's not. It's every, there are some part. people. There are some. There people are though. some. Pe- there, like there, I feel like people that are looking like deep into it and are getting into like the money side and stuff like that, but like people that like 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 the storyline and like want to keep everything together and don't want to but but, but that's ruined. the thing though it's like but that's what the reason why disney's kind of being stupid is like they have already a lot of the money and they're already making some money they don't need the, this last character like they can yeah, still they, use him in the mcu with sony so why to just not keep it the way it is that's why it's annoying because know. disney yeah. got greedy for no like so like yeah, what no, sony I, wasn't I, prepared I, for I did, this like, it's I like, did read about that. I did read about them being greedy, which is unfortunate. Because it's like why. he was like Sony was fine with them being in. It's kind of it's almost like MCU. it's almost like football players. Like football players, yeah, yeah, they, yeah. Some of them make millions and millions of dollars. I mean, don't get me wrong; they get like their ass kicked, and they you know they play a tough so they play a tough sport. But like some of them ask for like twenty million dollar contracts when they should not be right. making that much money. You know, you don't need. I mean, when I played in high school, I got my ass kicked. 
I mean, yeah, don't get me wrong, we weren't playing in front of thousands and thousands of people or hundreds of thousands of people, yeah. but you know, I I didn't get a dime. I don't know. It, it, it is. <laughs> I mean, it I, is that, no, that crazy. was a really bad example. But like, you don't need to get paid twenty two million dollars to Nobody, catch a but football. But even if even if like, I mean, even if, if you're he like is, the, if you're like in the uber uber echelon of like the NFL, yeah, you can get twenty two million dollars. Yeah, that's what I'm like, saying. Like, even if he is, like, it's like that's fine. But how big of a jump is he trying to make? Like, is, is he making like two million? And he's like, I want fifty. That's oh, so, much. oh yeah, some, I mean? like, oh yeah. Some people, some people would. I mean, yes. Like, I guess, I guess, when you're thinking about like money wise, with like, like if it's Tom Brady and he's like going up like a mil or two, it's like I kind of get it. Like he's trying to just you know. But if yeah, it's like Tom a Brady, big Tom jump, Brady, you're like, okay, Tom let's Brady's relax. not like he's not the he doesn't make the most money in the NFL. He's like the yeah, I don't he's know in, much like, about in NFL, the '90s, like the top. Like he's in, he's like number one hundred yeah. person. To, like, Plus, make, all like, these people money make like a stupid amount of money, anyways, from like also well, sponsorships yeah, they and have, like they have ads sponsorships, and endorsements, it's, advertising. It's kind of, it gets a little bit crazy. Deals. It gets crazy. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's a ton. Yeah. Some you know, like LeBron James. He they has a shoe line. They could retire and it'd be fine, realistically. Yeah. Oh my god. Start yeah, like invest in some business and they yeah, like Tom Brady has his own you know cookbook and like his own like you know all of his like own recipes and different meals that he has. You know, it's insane. You can do a ton of stuff. It's just some some of them all they do is just they play football and then that's it. They just like, get none of them will do I mean, yeah. brands, you know, sponsorships or anything like that. Some of them will just play football and that's it. It's weird. I, it's we'll, we'll see. I don't. A, lot of, I don't... a lot of them. A lot of them don't save money too. That's why. Yeah, I heard here. about that. Like, I heard that's, about that. Like Gron, like Gronkowski, he did a wicked good job with, you know, saving his money. Like I think, all of the NFL money that he made, like all of his football money. I don't know if it's the endorsement money or all of his NFL money, but he didn't spend any of it. Like it's you, all saved up. He actually, by the way, I met him. Oh he, really? Yeah, he came to my high school. Oh really? Yeah, it was crazy. It oh was so weird because I remember he had, um, like, he came to the gym and we're like, we're all there. But the, the yeah. dude is huge. Like, like you know, yeah, he's obviously massive. huge. But when you see him in front of you, yeah, I, it's I was, yeah, terrifying. I, to him one of the page, I was able to talk to him at one of the Patriots practices. Yeah, no, and it, dude, his yeah, he's hand he's a cool on it, like just his hand is terrible. It's like it's literally a human size. Like, yeah, I, sh- I, sh- I shook his hand. It's like shaking it's gorillas. Scary hand. dude, and like he yeah. he did one I mean, of his I'm whole like you know with the football <laughs> and just kind of like throwing it down on the ground, and oh, it was terrifying. Oh, I was spike. like, yeah, that I don't know, I don't know anything about the, the NFL, bro, the but yeah, it was spike. crazy. And then when he left, like he was leaving, and everybody was still in the gym. I had gone out of the gym too at the same time, like so we were both in the same hallway, and he was walking out with his bodyguards. And he like looked back and said hi to like me and a bunch of people, and I was just like, and it was the weirdest thing because at that point he was literally like on the same level as I am, and it was just like he yeah. was so big, like like yeah, so big, like it's like it's person. like scary big. It's not like because keep in mind too, I'm also smaller than you are too. <laughs> like I like yeah. Well, how tall are you? Like five eight, five nine. eight five nine ish. Yeah. yeah. Like he's just, he's huge. It, it was scary. I was like, how how is that a human? Like there's some people that I'm <laughs> yeah, like, how are you human? <laughs> Like we're the same species. I'm like, what? Yeah, it's it's, it's terrifying. Yeah, a person. But uh, but yeah, we're approaching forty minutes now, David. I don't we know are. what you want to do. So well, if you want to right here. Well, before we end, I don't know why this came randomly came in my head. Speaking of huge people, Shaq is also stupid, stupid big. Yeah, he yeah ha- he's that's dumb. Have you seen the picture yeah, with him and his like girlfriend? No, you have to, I haven't. Oh I'll my god, you have to look that up. It is. Yeah. A crazy picture. Like you're it gonna die is. if you saw it. No, it's like it. You'll think it's Photoshop because her his girlfriend too is it's also so like the exact small. opposite because she's super small too. So it's like the exact Actually, polar like opposite. Four and ten. Probably I I wouldn't actually Absolutely. doubt it. And it's like his foot is literally bigger than just her whole body. It's not even. I'm not even exaggerating. <laughs> I'm not. Exa- it's like scary. Like is I it? want I'll to show. It it. I kind of wanted to see it now to to like to get your reaction. Uh, I'll, I'll look it up. I'll look like up. look up. Uh, let me see if I can. Shaquille O'Neal. Yeah, it's just Shaq, uh, Shaq girlfriend picture. Let's see if that pops up. Oh my god! Are you seeing it where they're holding hands and walking? What? He's in like his shorts. Dude, his shorts are pants. That's for what's me. Wait, but but oh did you god, see dude, him? He's so tall. <laughs> he's a giant. It's not even tall. It's dude, his giant. arm. His arm is the size of her body. His like realistically, yeah. his arm is actually. Dude, I mean, it's well, terrifying. no, no. Realistically, it's not. But like, it's her head just goes up to like his belly button. Like that honestly, is insane, dude. 
I saw a picture with him like holding the basketball with like one hand, and yeah, he could easily fit a basketball in what? one hand. And it's like terrifying the way it looks. It literally looks like he's holding a marble, not a ball. I'm like, what? Like, literally look up Shaq holding basketball, and just you'll see what I'm talking about. Oh my god, I'm looking Do at you this see picture that? right now. It's no, like, I, I, no, I, no, I, well, I scroll down a little bit because I'm on Google Images, and I looked down, I looked at a picture with like if like his girlfriend was his height and he was her height and it's so like she looks like it's like from a movie <laughs> no i doesn't tell it looks like she looks like it doesn't a look person real. like yeah oh it doesn't look real at all it's so weird literally but look, it is look up shack Shaq. Sh look up shack like holding basketball it's terrifying it's like it, it's it's i don't know it's it, like i'm speechless honestly just looking at it right now it's weird it's just weird yeah, it looks like a marble. Like he's holding it with like his fingertips. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It it's make so any sense weird, dude. Like I, it's just the fact that he's it also. It human. literally looks like a like a do, small like. Do you one see of the like picture? Small bowling balls that you can palm. <laughs> do you see the picture of him holding a water bottle, drinking out of it? No. Do you? Oh, see <laughs> oh yeah, I do. Look at <laughs> it's that. So, it's so dude, small. it looks like. That's so weird. What the hell? Dude, it's terrifying. If if he oh was in front of me, I don't know how I'd feel. Like I don't know, like I don't, I'm not the type it's that I feel crazy. like I'd be really starstruck. But I, I wouldn't be starstruck with him. I just I I don't know how I'd feel. I'd just be like, what? That's, that's starstruck. Yeah. <laughs> well, I guess, but it's not like, but, but for like, yeah, you're not you like, know. You're it's not, not like because a he's girl, a star. Just, it's because he's huge. It's <laughs> because he's so tall. Like, <laughs> yeah. What? Yeah. That's pretty. Oh, crazy. I want to see someone like that's like a legit like like tiny, like I don't I, like Joey Pretty next to him. <laughs> oh, or like a midget, like Big Nick. Well, I guess. Or like we man. That'd be so Jackass. funny. That'd be so funny. It's just I, the guy is crazy. Yeah. It's okay. Crazy. All right. Well, but yeah. Next time, hopefully, we'll have Shane on the podcast. Um, and you know, he'll he'll say something interesting. He'll tell us. You know what? I'll have him talk to talk about what the hell are you shooting today. Exactly. Yeah, sure, people are interested. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, curious. For sure. All right, but I need to go eat dinner. I'm getting hungry. I'm gonna have some mac and cheese and a turkey sandwich. I'm, I'm gonna hear. <laughs> so, I'm, I'm gonna eat some pasta with broccoli. It's gonna be sick. Oh, that sounds so good. I, it is oh, really God. good, is what it is. Damn it! Now I want pasta with broccoli. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, guys. I'll, I'll send I'm you Josh from Amberg, That's David Takla. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, Shane that is Danny. He is gonna join us next time. He's our other post person. As soon as he um, stops yeah, getting lost. Oh, yeah, guys, go check out my YouTube channel. Um, I just I'll, did a video with David Dobrik. Um, I'll have everything in Josh the description. Van just look up Josh, like J-O-S-H, everybody knows this. I'll, I'll have look everything Josh. in the description. I'll put all of the... Yeah. All of oh, stuff. yeah, perfect. Yeah, yeah, look up Josh Van. Look up Josh Van and you're good. And that should pop up. Minivan or just Van? V-A-N. V-A-N. Okay, no minivans. Like a, like a white van. Like, it's like... Where people <laughs> used to, like, oh, have kids. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay, let's get off. All right, bye, guys. I'm showing off my microphone. <laughs> I hate you.